Here are my top five tips for revising A-level biology. The first one would be print off your specification. Now I might be old school, but I think a paper copy is best because then you can refer to it at all times. So you can use it to figure out where you're up to in school, what topics you've covered, what topics you've still got left to do, but you can also use it to check off what topics you've revised, which topics you've done past paper questions for, which topics you're confident with and which topics you might need to spend a little bit more time on. It also will hopefully save you from revising content that isn't on your spec because that would be wasting your time and you can end up trying to learn too much information. The second tip would be do as many past paper questions as possible. These are easily available to you online and across my TikTok and my YouTube account, you can access hundreds of past paper questions. Obviously, if you are using my videos, make sure you pause the video and try and write your answer before you look at my answer. But the more questions you expose yourself to before the exam, the better. Tip number three, look at mark schemes. The mark schemes, yeah, they need to become your best friend as well as the specification because we know biology is one of the hardest A-levels and we know that's because of the specificity of the mark schemes and the language that they use. So you need to have seen as many mark schemes as possible. Again, with all of the questions that I post on TikTok or YouTube, I do go through the mark scheme answers with the correct language. So make sure you are using the correct terminology in your answers. Tip number four, I'm not a massive fan of flashcards, I've got to say, but I am a big fan of blurting. Now, blurting is basically where you just get a piece of paper and you dump everything on there that you know about a topic. And I think this is great because it doesn't take a lot of preparation. You can do it at any time. All you need is a pen and a piece of paper and you can just write down the topic title in the middle and then annotate it with just anything you know about that topic. It doesn't have to be in any kind of order, but what you can do when you've finished is go back to your thorough notes and see which bits you've missed and then add them on to your big sheet of paper. Tip number five, uh, this may be a personal one, but this is what I found worked best for me when I was doing my A-levels, speak your knowledge out loud. So you've done your past papers, you've checked your spec, you've done your blurting, now you're going to teach someone else. So you're going to find someone, they might not want to listen to you, but you're going to tell them all about a topic from biology. So you could teach them all about respiration, you could teach them all about enzymes, it doesn't really matter if they're not listening to you. But I find for sure, if I can speak it all out loud, I know it has stuck in my head. And um, I can explain it to someone else. If I can explain it to someone else clearly, then I obviously know my stuff. So they would be my five top tips. Let me know in the comments which of those things you already use and which of those things you might go ahead and start using to help with your A-level biology revision.